Hi, One Hour Smart Home here, and today we're going to show you how to connect your Nest E to Alexa. So we've got our Nest E on the left-hand side of the screen here, and we want to connect it to Alexa. So first, you need to make sure you have your Nest E set up and installed and your Alexa device set up and installed. Now that you've done that, you're going to go over to the Amazon app. So I click on Amazon Alexa, and now I want to add a device. So I'm going to go down here at the bottom and click on Devices. A whole bunch of different stuff is going to pop up, but what I want to do now is add a device. So I go up here to the top right hand corner and I click on the plus symbol. That's going to let me add a device. So I select this very top option here and I want to add a device. So I go down and I'm looking for Nest E, which is thermostats. So I see thermostats here and that will let me connect my Google Nest E thermostat to Alexa. So I go ahead and click on this one at the very top. It says download the Google Nest app, which we've already done. We've set up our thermostat and returned to the Alexa app. So we're ready to do this now. Just go ahead and click continue and you can get started connecting your Nest E to Alexa. Now, this is the Google Nest skill that connects the Nest E to Alexa. I recommend looking at these voice commands. You need to use very specific voice commands when connecting your Nest thermostat to Alexa to make sure that you're able to control it. A lot of people will connect it and then they don't understand the commands you need to use to control your Nest Thermostat E and have problems. So go ahead and look at those. But all you need to do here is go ahead and click on the enable to use at the top. All right, now Nest is asking us for our permissions to connect the Nest E to Alexa. So we're just gonna go ahead and say yes to both of these. Slide them over so they're blue if you haven't done so already. And then you're just gonna go ahead and click done. Now it's going to ask you to log in with the Google account that you use to set up your Nest E. So go ahead and sign in with that if you haven't done so already. It asks us here to confirm our choices. We go ahead and say yes, that we want to share information with Amazon Alexa from our Nest E. So we're going to go ahead and allow this. Now it says our Google Nest has been successfully linked to Amazon Alexa. It says close this window to discover smart home devices you can control with Alexa. So we go ahead and do that. It says smart home devices must be discovered before they can be used with Alexa. We're gonna go ahead and discover devices. Now it may take up to 45 seconds for your Nest E to connect to Alexa. So we're just gonna go ahead and skip through this and let you see what happens when they do connect. Great, our Google Nest thermostat has been found and connected. Your thermostat has been added to your Alexa account. Next, continue setting up your device. So we're just gonna go ahead and say set up. We don't wanna add this to a group, but you could do so if you wanted to. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click skip here. And now our Nest E thermostat is set up with Alexa and is working. So we could just go ahead and say, Alexa, set the office to 72 degrees. And Alexa would make that adjustment on our Nest E thermostat. So thank you for watching. We're just going to go ahead and click done here. Our Nest thermostat E has now been added to Alexa. Please go ahead and give us that thumbs up, like, or subscribe if you want to support this channel and click on any of the links below if you want to learn more about Nest or you want to support us. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.